Hello there puzzle friends again. We are here as every Saturday with a new video about jigsaw puzzles. Here as you can see, this is upside down. Here as you can see, I have uh, uh, some Ravensburger puzzles. Ravensburger puzzles. And it's, um, what's more special about them, they are exit puzzles. Four different puzzles. Everyone with a different design. There are more of them, actually. Uh, there are no, there do not exist only these four. I do. I have these four. I have two to make on my waiting list, as we puzzle say, and two I have already made. So, without further ado, let's get let's get into this video. This will be an in-depth review. I will try to make also timestamps so you can search the video through and go to the specific uh, thing that you are interested. First things first, these um, exit puzzles that I have are 559 pieces, all of them. Now they exist uh, more of them uh, with a different number of pieces. Uh, the dimensions, as you can see here and under, I have two, actually two puzzles, one is on top of the other, uh, that are already ready, already made, but we will see them later. Here is uh, the one that's closed, I believe it's uh, the vampire, how it's called, the vampire castle. I haven't made this one. Uh, to tell you the truth, I, also, I already have the music when I make the time lapse for the other two. There is also there is already time lapse in the channel. Uh, feel free to check it out. Uh, let's start as we, as I usually see in other reviews, and as I will do with the box. The box is somewhat different on the dimensions of the what is known to be in the Europe, because I do believe in the USA they have another dimensions on the boxes. On the Europe boxes of Ravensburger, yeah, always you find this stamp, you know it's a Ravensburger. So let's compare it. This is another Ravensburger puzzle I have already have made also. Uh, as you can see, the dimensions is quite different. Uh, this is way brighter than this one uh, you may think yeah the pieces are uh, less inside this well they do they are less but the final dimensions of the product are the same with the 1000 pieces puzzle of a Ravensburger and many other brands for that matter so let's get this off the way because it's not our what we are interested in and this is what we are interested in. I do have these four pieces. This is one. Here it's somewhat um, showing that ah, inside these are some riddles. You have to question yourself how do they pass together. And uh, it's also a piece, uh, a puzzle pieces. It's a puzzle. Uh, most of the time, actually, by the pieces, by, yeah, actually, this is not the case. The Ravensburger puzzle, they do have this. Uh, which you may think it's um, somewhat of um, design, so to say, but actually it's supposed to be how big the pieces are. In this case, I do believe they are not. Let's see that for ourselves. Yeah, the pieces are a little bit bigger. But we'll get to the pieces later. Uh, here are some informations. The name in other... Um, other languages and here also some information what actually is the exit puzzle uh, I'm not going to read this you can also read it for yourself you can pause the video if you want uh, here you can also see some scrums here it says it's for more or one person the dimensions as I already said yeah it's actually here hidden under the price maybe it's let's Take another one without the price. The dimensions are 70 times 50 or 27 inches times 20 inches. They are made in 2018. 
So let's open this up. Uh, the, the box, as I already said, contains yeah, the puzzle pieces. This, and these pieces are also in the bag of Rammetsburger. They are, um, for, uh, for manufacturing reasons, uh, they are inside the box, but you do not have to use them. You don't need them. If you do, yeah, yeah, they will complete the picture a little outside, but they will not help you to solve the riddle. They are not that there for that reason. Here is uh, some small uh, booklet, and inside is in the different languages the story that's supposed to be happening on the picture. Uh, and the exit person, so to say. And he, this is one, this one. As you can see, there, there exists some puzzle dust inside. Uh, I had a comment that saying that uh, the Ravensburger puzzles are notorious for having many puzzle dust. Yeah, they do have, for me it's not a problem, but maybe for somebody it's a problem. And this is the envelope that's also inside. I haven't opened it yet. That uh, shows you the answer to the riddle. And uh, enough said with the box. That's not the most interesting part. The most interesting part are, is the jigsaw puzzle itself and maybe the riddles themselves. As you can see here, the pieces and the quality is uh, what you would expect from a Ravensburger puzzle. Uh, the, the image is very crisp, very nice, very clear. You can see it. I actually did start from this lamp as you can see in the time lamps, let's put them out of the way. Uh, ah, that's also important to say. This is the box, and this is the final image. It's somewhat different. Um, if you haven't done it, that you think it's a spoiler, yeah, you can feel free to not see the rest of the video because you will see the already image or. You can see the ready image if that's uh, difficult for you, if you don't have a, an image to relate to. Having that said, it's not that different. For example, the cut here, you see here a cut. Here there is no cut. It's not that or much of a difference. Uh, to my knowledge, you don't have to have the box to solve the riddles. You can solve them on here. Also, having that said, the puzzle pieces, the quality is what you would expect from a Ravensburger puzzle. I haven't glued that, so we can see them up close. Here, that's what how they look like. And they go well together. They do have this... Uh, they don't say it, but it's like the ones that ha they say it, they have this soft click technology. Uh, these, puzzle, these pieces are somewhat special. They're a little bit bigger than the 1000, as you expect, since they, they take the same amount of space and they're less. Uh, and what's important about this puzzle, actually the, the border, and maybe some of the pieces, that, for that I'm not sure, because the way I solved the puzzles, I didn't find something like this. The border is... Um, somewhat difficult than normal puzzles or at least for the puzzles from Ravensburger because the pieces are made that way and that's uh, on purpose they're made that way that they can good pass together so this piece may go to another place and you think it fits and so and because it's not that clear of the image sometimes in this case I do believe it's more clear on the other puzzle it's the temple grounds it's not that clear on all the cases. Uh, so it's I wouldn't suggest that you should uh, start from the border because of this matter. But then again, it's your decision, it's your puzzle. You can make it the way you want it. But expect that it will be somewhat more difficult to make the borders for that reason. Uh, having that said, leaving the puzzle stuff aside, let's go to the exit part of the puzzle. 
What does actually exit means? Uh, the story is that you, um, somehow you are um, found in this place, so to say, and you are supposed to find a way out. You are somewhat of trapped, so to say. I'm not sure if you can see it on the image. Here, let's take them away, or let's do this. Here, on the piece, you can see there is a number. 48 for this example and what you have to do is to solve some riddles in the books for example in this book there is some text here are also some texts on the on the books on the cat here where the cat was sitting there are also some numbers here are also some shapes and some numbers and stuff like this and what that means that you have to see and find this uh, stuff on the jigsaw puzzles. Uh, they are all spread all everywhere. And if you find them, here are some clear colors or so. Having that said, that's kind of a spoiler, so to say. But then again, it's uh, when in a deep, in-depth review, uh, we have to chalk some of the things. Um, the colors here are also riddles and stuff like this. I will not go all through through all the riddles, but then we always then it doesn't make any sense. Or maybe you want them to do. Maybe we will make later a video that's a solution video and not a review video. Having that said, these are the riddles. You have to solve the riddles. Uh, that doesn't mean if you are good with uh, jigsaw puzzles that it, that you are good with these riddles. They are on a completely different level, a completely different kind of thing. Maybe you are better in these riddles than the puzzle itself. Maybe you are better in the puzzle itself. It's something different. Uh, and it's supposed to give you uh, more fun, more time to do something with the puzzle. I do like the combination. So you make the puzzle and you make the, then again, you make the exit puzzle, the exit riddle, so to say. Uh, if you solve them, you will find a, a number. And this number is supposed to be on these edge pieces. When you find all the edge pieces that you need, I believe they have seven riddles or something like this, then you can put these pieces together. That's why they are made that they can be good put together. And if you put these pieces together in the right order, then you have your solution to the puzzle. Uh, and that may be, for example, the Ravensburg have made the one that you make a meteorite go, a meteorite go, go away, something like this. For this one, I will not tell you what the solution is because you may want to solve it yourself. Uh, that was actually about this puzzle and, and I have to tell you some, uh, also a secret trick as I usually do in these in-depth reviews I do. These actually, these puzzles actually, and that's uh, common with Ravensburg puzzles, when you buy them they do have a code number here. I'm not sure if that's the only code number with this picture. But the ones I got and the ones I solved already, I will see it if the, if that's, uh, this is happening on the other ones too. This one is uh, the 951952. And the number here, 58, it may be also a code for something else. That's not the point. The point is that this puzzle actually has exactly the same grid cut as the other puzzle, the Temple Grounds. This one. And uh, if you don't believe me, I can prove it to you. Let's say we take this piece apart. So we have these pieces, all right? And we take these pieces apart. But uh, we need these pieces apart. Here. And you may say, yeah, yes, they may look similar, but they are not exactly the same. And they are exactly the same. Here. They fit perfectly. 
here also. Nobody can tell the difference. Here they are. I don't know if that's uh, on purpose gemacht. I don't know if it's something that they made the grid. Okay, we do this like this. I don't know if this is also happening on these ones. They have, um, I have yet to make. But again, it's funny to find some. It's very hidden stuff about the jigsaw puzzles you buy. Anyway, the, the video is actually coming to an end. Uh, it's already 15 minutes. If you are still here, feel free to write me in the comments if you like the video, if you like this type of videos, if you want to see something less like this. I will. I think I will do some in-depth reviews for the brands in general. Uh, for Ravensburger, for Dino Toys, we have many brands that are our collection. Having that said, uh, I will be glad to be hearing from you. It's always interesting to see how the channel develops and how the channel grows. Thanks for watching and happy puzzling, happy riddle solving on this case. Goodbye.